In this video, we're going to get a lot of practice thinking, hearing, feeling, and expressing a repeated musical pulse using both sides of our musical brains and bodies. And we're going to do that by clapping our hands in our laps using three different musical patterns. Importantly, though, in a very disciplined way, we're going to play with a metronome at various tempos from really slow to really fast. And if that wasn't enough, we're going to do our best to verbalize the meter by counting out loud as all this is going on. It's going to be fun, and you're going to learn a lot more than you expect. I promise. Let's go. You hear that? That's 60 beats per minute. Let's go. Let's play all the downbeats in both hands simultaneously. Ready? And let's count the meter. It's one four meter just as one and one and one and one. Ready? Here we go. One and 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 one. And notice as I'm doing this, I never stop moving, right? It's not one stop or and stop, right? It's a continuous cycle, continuous gestures that really it's kind of hard to tell. In fact, they're darn near impossible to tell, like, when does the one begin and when does the end begin, right? So here it goes, one and one and one and one. And the other thing is, when you do this, make sure you're not flamming. So in other words, your hand are not asynchronous, that they're not, one hand's not playing ahead of the other. So you don't want to go, or, right? You want those hands to be, behave as if they're one gigantic, Ten finger hand with the same musical mind. Got it? And the other thing is, when you're doing this, right, you don't have to attack. Like you're you're doing battle with something, right? It's not. And at the same time, it's not relaxed in the sense that you just collapse, like. Right? If you're doing this the right way, the proper technique is to have this sense of continuous flow and it's just a circular sequence of very natural gestures. One and one and one and one. Got it? Now let's do another pattern. Let's do downbeats on our left hand and upbeats in our right. One and 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 one. Again, notice you never stop moving. Right? Now let's do the mirror image. Let's do down beats on our right hand, up beats on our left. Got it? Now let's try 100 beats per minute. Same three patterns. First, hands together on all the down beats. One and 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 one. Down beats left, up beats right. One and 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 one. Down beats right, up beats left. One and 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 one. And you know, let yourself go, right? If you feel your body start to tense up, right? The solution is not to try harder. The solution is to just let your body do what it already naturally knows how to do. Give it a go, it'll work. And if it doesn't, well, keep on trying. You'll get it, I promise. Let's try 140 beats per minute. Hands together on the downbeats. Here we go. 
one and 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 one. Down beats left, up beats right. One and 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 one. Down beats right, up beats left. One and 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 one. Who I'm having a hard time getting those uh, syllables out of my mouth here. So you might notice that this starts starts to get a little mm, more uncomfortable, all right? And that's okay. Uh, just when you find yourself feeling like you're tensing up and you're trying too hard, do the opposite. Just kind of oh, pretend it's like no big deal, right? Right? Promise you're going to get this if you stay with it, right? But you got to do these. You can't just watch. You have to do them. Got it? Now we're really cooking. That's 180 beats per minute. Let's give it a go. I don't think I can say one and one. It's too fast. I'm just going to do the ones. Ready? In fact, I'm just going to do wah, 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 wah. How's that? Hands together on the downbeats. Wah, 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 wah. Downbeats left, upbeats right. Wah, 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 wah. Downbeats right, upbeats left. Wah, 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 wah. Oh, I got a little loose there, you might have noticed. But, you know, you see that? I I even have uh, work to do on my rhythm. But anyway, stay with this. If you feel yourself tense up, just tell yourself, you know, like, ah, it's no big deal, man. Just, nah, I'm just here, you know, doing this. No big deal, right? Allow me to close this video out with some words of encouragement. Don't despair if you find this difficult. You're not alone. It took me a while to really find my inner musical timekeeper and rhythm. Um, but I will make you a bet. If you give this a good faith effort for just a few minutes today, tomorrow it's going to be easier. And it may click for you tomorrow. And even if it doesn't, give it another few minutes of good faith effort. And the day after that, it'll be easier. Guaranteed. And so on and so on. And I bet it won't take long before you feel something click. And you go, wow, I don't have to think about this anymore. I don't even have to try it. The rhythm just becomes an integral part of the way you think and hear and feel and move your body. It's going to be as if you never didn't know how to do this. So stay with it, and it's going to pay huge dividends in your rhythm and your piano technique. I promise.